going to start off by applying an eyeshadow base to my lids. This is going to ensure that my shadows stick, stay vibrant, and last all throughout the summer heat. Then I'm taking Peach Smoothie from Makeup Geek and this is going to act as a transitional shade above the crease. Using Beaches and Cream, also by Makeup Geek, I'm using this as a highlight. And taking Coastal Sense Volcanic Blast, this is going to be where I map out where I want the most intensity of color and where I want it to be more soft. Taking Hot Tamale, this is going to be concentrated on the outer corner and then I'm taking Vibrant Red which is going to be softened in the inner corner. Using this orange color, I'm going to apply this above all of the shades and this is going to give a nice ombre blended effect. Then taking Beaches and Cream, once again applying this all over the lid. Taking the Sparkle Dust by Wet n Wild, I'm using this as a highlight color so I'm applying this on the inner corner, kind of working my way on the lower lash line halfway through and then on the brow bone. Then I'm taking this Nude Eye Pencil by Rimmel London and this is going to add a more brightening effect on the inner corner. And I didn't have a brown pencil so I'm using my eyebrow pencil and applying this on the outer corner to meet that nude pencil color. Then I'm taking one of my favorite mascaras to date. This is Perversion Mascara by Urban Decay and applying a few coats to the top and bottom lashes. Then I'm using this orange corrector by NYX and I'm just using this underneath the eyes and creating a sharp line, applying it to any dark circles that I have just to kind of brighten that area up a little bit. And I'm taking my sponge by Real Techniques and just blending it all in. This is the sponge I'm going to use for pretty much everything on my face. Um, now I'm using a BB cream to even out my skin tone, one of my favorites. Then I'm taking Undetectable Bronzer by Sonia Kashuk and applying this on the outer perimeter of my face. Here I'm taking a NYX long eye pencil to contour my nose and then taking my Bin Nye Banana Powder and applying this all over the places where I want it to be matte. Here I'm using my matte face powder by CoverGirl to go over that undetectable bronzer and adding Hippie Chick, this is a NYX lipstick and topping it off with an LA Girl Glaze lipstick and hot mess.